Does anyone here have a cell phone on them? No. no. Yeah. Okay, but he does. Okay. And did you see where he took out his cell phone from? That's your principal. And you know where I keep mine? Mine is here in my back pocket, right? So when you guys grow up, you're going to have a cell phone probably in your pocket. Would you like, who would like to demonstrate? You'd like to? Come on over. Okay, what's your name? Tomer. Tomer? Tomer? I'm going to say it in the Israeli accent. Tomer here is going to grow up someday, am I right? Yeah. Probably. If we and Tomer here will probably keep his cell phone. Hold that. There's Tomer's cell phone. Imagine that. And he's going to keep it here in his pocket. Tomer, put that in your pocket. What would happen if Tomer was alive in about 1880 to about 1920 is this. Tomer, close your eyes. He really trusts me. If Tomer was alive in that era, he would have this. Tomer, can you hold this? You can open your eyes. Hold that. Hold on. Hold on. There's Tomer's cell phone. You ready? And let me show you something. You want to place a call to Tomer? Here, ring now. You're calling Tomer. Okay, you want to answer that? Yeah. Okay, come on over and answer that. You're pretty good. Now talk to him. Hello. Where are you talking? Hello. Where are you talking? Oh, he's right there. <laughs> Where? Yeah, he's got to talk over there. <laughs> on your cell phone, you talk on the thing, but he's got to talk over there. This is called Bakelite. It's an old form of plastic. Uh, celluloid was the one of the earliest plastics that was around the mid 1800s, that long ago. But this is Bakelite, and you have to talk into this. But you know something? There's no other phone. There's no other phone. <laughs> you know something, Tomer? Grab a seat. Grab a seat, Tomer. Tomer's kind of old. Did you notice it? Because look at this old telephone he's using. He's an old guy. He's, you know, he's getting old. He's getting gray in the hair. Me, I'm a young guy. I've got a modern telephone. It's not this one you were looking at. Oh, I, mean, I ended up giving him my telephone. Right? <laughs> no, no, I got a modern telephone. Look at mine over here. This is my modern telephone. Do you know why this is modern? Why? Somebody care to guess? Oh. Go ahead. Because it's on like the Yeah, because do you remember how you had to you had to walk Wait. you had to go yeah. over and like yeah. talk into this? Yeah, Look what I can do. Could, um, a, yeah. Come over here. Okay, turn that, turn that thing over there. Okay, he's placing a call to me. Look what I have to do. I can do this. I can answer the phone, and I can walk all the way. Look how far I can go from my... This is like, this is like a cordless phone for them back then. They'd be like, hello, hello, Tomer, Tomer, get, get off your old telephone and call me on a cordless so you can walk away a little bit because you're so, you're so close to your phone. See, this was an invention. They had to think to themselves, once they invented that, they had to think to themselves, you know, I want to get a little further from my phone. I want a little bit of a smaller phone. These are all inventions. They had to think of this thing. You remember volume? They had to think of volume, and then they had to put it into these things. These are all inventions. When you go home, I want you to think about all the various parts, not just, oh, here it is, cell phone, but think of the parts of that cell phone, the light, the plastic, the paint. Everything is an invention. Oh, wait, I want to show you something important. You ready? Yeah. I want to show you how this works. You ready? Yeah. Oh, cool. Oh. Isn't that amazing? 